Simon, getting into the later stages of this six-game road swing, you've got the Toronto Marlies here tonight. A 3-2 loss to them on Wednesday. What did you see from the Moose in that game? Uh, I feel like we had a pretty good game. Uh, some, yeah, I don't know, not unlucky, but I feel like we played uh, really well and could have come out with a better result than, than what happened. Is that kind of one of those games that if you've won a few games, doesn't really sting too much, but when it's been a struggle of late, uh, you feel like you should have got that better result and can be a little frustrating? Yeah, exactly. It's it's frustrating when we feel like we play pretty good uh, and don't come out with a result. Uh, so we've got two huge games here uh, to end the road trip. Seems like over the last run of games, you've been able to get some solid efforts, whether it's through 40 minutes or pretty close to a full game like you did on Wednesday. So how do you start turning that good process into good results? I think we just got to find a way to, like you said, um, play the right way, the full game. Uh, and I think that just starts with like good start, good start of every period, uh, end the period well. Uh, and that usually sets up for a full good game. Well, as we were talking about, it's almost a two-week-long road trip here. You play six games, so it's not necessarily a heavy game schedule, but you're away from home for a long time. I guess, first off, would you rather play a bunch of games in a shorter amount of time, or do you prefer kind of the stretched-out trip? Uh, I don't know. Like, It's fun to, to be on road trips, long road trips, especially in the good cities like we are now. Uh, and we've been for a good amount of day in Toronto, which I've really been enjoying. But also at the same time, it's it's kind of tough to be on the road trip for, for a long time. But I like long road trips. Can it be a little bit of a mental grind for, for some guys, though? Like away from families, away from girlfriends and wives, things like that? Yeah, for sure. Especially guys with kids, too. Uh, can be tough, I can imagine. Uh, but also, like for everyone else, it is tough to not be in your own space. And so, so yeah, it is tough. So as you get down to these final couple of games, how does the team focus in to make sure you get everything you need to out of the uh, the next 48 hours or so? Yeah, we just got to focus on playing like playing the right way, uh, doing the the basic stuff out there, uh, and that with that usually comes the rest. Uh, so yeah, that's the main focus I think.